Hi, my name is Dr. Jay Ayer. I'm a consultant gynecologist and a laparoscopic surgeon and currently I co-chair the newly established surgical training unit. The newly established unit basically aims at formalizing surgical training. Surgical training is all about having a mentorship which improves patient outcomes whilst mitigating risk. There used to be a Halstedian model where you you know, see one, then do one and teach one. However, in today's modern era, it, it's not always quite so simple. Therefore, formalizing surgical training uh, basically aligns the objectives of training along with the objectives of the respective royal colleges that drive the training uh, in, in order to uh, deliver it in a standardized and formalized fashion. When you're teaching surgical skills in a non-patient environment, which is what we initially aim to do, it tends to be less stressful, less threatening for the trainees and therefore I think they'll be able to assimilate those skills far better and have far more confidence with, with a reduced learning curve. They'll find that when they finally go and confront a patient in a clinical environment, they're, they're far more at ease. So the idea is to shepherd them through their first year and then take them through their more complex skills in the latter years. Once we get to those complex skills, those will be specialty specific, but basic surgical skills don't change. There's no point in whipping five different surgeons in five different specialities to do the same thing if you can have an overarching unit that looks after it. What I'd like to say to students coming through is that you know, they need to express their interest and show it by you know, dedication to patient care and attending you know, surgical cases with us. So I think we're well on our way and it's going to be uh, exciting times ahead. I'm looking forward to it.